Now that you have it in a document, we need to image trace this drawing. And an image trace is going to convert it from an image to a vector program. And a vector program allows you to go in and manipulate each of the shapes. So we have a one-step process that should work pretty well for you. We're going to go to image trace and we're going to choose black and white logo. That should convert your drawing to a rather clean version for Illustrator. Our second step is to go into expand. Now you can see that it's highlighted with lots of shapes. The problem is we have to get the white out from the black. And there's white inside our objects as well as around. So we're going to go and get our group select tool. I'm going to click on the outside box. But that doesn't select all of the white that might be contained in this object. So you need to go to select same and we're going to go fill and stroke. Then on your keyboard look for delete. And we can go back to our move tool and as we move it over into the gray area of, of your document if you can see areas that you now you can go one step further and if there are pieces that you want to go inside letters that are fully contained shapes. Now that you have it converted into your vector shape, using your direct select tool, you can go in and clean up a little areas. If there's some things that need to be deleted, you can just select on the shape and you can delete pieces that you might not need. You can click and drag whole sections and move them. Or you can even take a section that might need be repeated. Go into our reflect tool. And reflecting. So again, using the direct select tool, you can go in and clean up areas that you would see that you would like to remove. Now, if they're full of a whole object, you have one more option, and that is your erase tool. So if there is something that you need to erase as well, you can go in and erase it. And I think that's pretty good. And I'm going to take one last section and copy it. So there you have it. You can go in and modify your drawing, removing excess lines or going in and erasing lines that maybe you didn't want with our eraser tool. I'm looking for symmetricalness here, so I'm going to do one more copy. I'm going to V, so I can put that right there. Remember, you must use your direct select tool. The direct select tool really is just going into group objects and allowing you to select individually objects within that group. And now that you have it where you think looks best and cleaned up, any lines that again need to be erased, repeated, reflected, and now you have a scanned image which is now ready to be used on your selfie. If you haven't taken a selfie, now would be the time to go do it.